Hey folks, I'm back again. Unfortunately, it just jumped out there at the back end of Colin's video clip. So if you're watching this and you're thinking, what is Dr. Rowe talking about? Go back and watch the previous video, which is essentially entitled, are you getting the best out of your sourcing agent or is your sourcing agent giving you the information that you need? So what we saw there was Colin out on site. Now he was actually out on site assessing a property for a client. And this is a property that had the potential and has the potential to do, to be developed out. So that means it's going through planning permission. But if you notice what he was doing there, and this is really important, is he was actually taking out measure, measuring devices and, and getting the dimensions. If you're a property investor and you're using a sourcing agent, I don't think it's enough just to have a sourcing agent go, oh, I found this deal on Rightmove, or I went out and looked at this property deal. It looks like it needs some work doing on it. And I think if you spend about this much, you know, it should be worth this much. There you go, bang, and they charge you a sourcing fee. That is not sufficient. What I'm personally looking for is somebody that's really switched on, very engaged, and knows how to assess the property from some several different angles, multiple exit strategies, and at the same time, as you saw there, is measuring the property to see if we can get the maximum use, particularly if you're looking at southern-based properties. Southern-based properties are often measured on square footage or square meterage, so one of the things that Colin is exceptionally good at when working with clients and certainly working with us as well is he'll look at a room and go, well, actually, you know, we've got a chimney stack here, for example. We can take that out and we can knock that section through there and suddenly win you back another square, two square meters. If you're selling a property, that adds a lot more value to the value of the property. If it costs you a thousand quid per square meter to do that, but the actual market value in that area is, say, four thousand pounds per square meter, you just got like three to four times increase there. So these are subtle things we need to be aware of. If you're looking to do a HMO, for example, you want your sourcing agent to have checked all the dimensions to see if you can get inside. Uh, you know, can you get it above a single room to a double room? That increases your cash flow on the property as well, which ultimately re inc increases your return on investment. And has that sourcing agent taken enough information? If you notice what he was doing, he was appraising it, checking back with the client. What's the client looking for? Does this meet the client's needs? You're really looking for somebody that's helping bespoke your business is really tailoring it down. So don't just pick any old sourcing agent. I'm extremely averse to the ones that just mass mail out to people, the ones that you'll often find online or the ones that you meet at these networking events where they're just chucking out their card to everybody. I want somebody that works specifically with clients uh, and is happy to really sit down and find out from me what, what I'm looking for, understands my financial situation, how much I've got available to play with and then finds jigsaw pieces to fit my overall picture of what I'm looking to create. That would be my suggestion at this stage. Um, he actually sent me another video of him going out and looking at a potential development, which I thought was great. So I'm, I'm probably going to get him back on with that and see if I can dovetail it so that we play the video and then I have him live with me and we talk about that as well. So look out for that. That will probably come out, if not in the next couple of days, um, sometime next week.